Cause I don't want to. What is wrong? You keep looking at your phone. I know I don't mean to be a buzzkill, but I just got a notification that the mainline universe was just erased. Ah, uh, whatever. I went back to Earth, all the way back in episode two, and I'd say that's enough work for another uh, 2,000 years or so for old Jesus here. No, man, I, I gotta fix this. Look, I I'll be right back. Wow, it's all like totally gone. Uh, all right, well, I'll just fix this. Oh, oh, what just happened? Am I alive again? What was that? Was that the afterlife? Why were there so many flamingos? Whoa, whoa, hey man, no spoilers. Don't spoil the afterlife. Hey everybody, look, Santa, he's back. He's alive again. Oh, God. Oh, I hope I never see those talking flamingos again. Hey, uh, Mr. Vauatu, look, I know you're the all-powerful one, so I, I had a question. I keep having all this insane, epic stuff keep happening to me, but it, but it always happens off-screen, and, and, and nobody sees it. Why does that keep happening? I mean, it seems pretty obvious that happens because it sounds pretty expensive to animate. Uh, no, no. There's actually uh, a very good reason for that. And that reason is, uh, oh, that in the future, Todd is destined to become the chosen one. Really? Wow, okay, uh, that's amazing. Yeah, that's uh, actually uh, why I'm here. Uh, Merlin and Santa, why don't you go take Todd to the land of magic so he can discover his destiny as the chosen one? You got it, boss. All right, ladies, buckle up, because we are going on an adventure. Oh, it's ginger ale on a plane! Welcome to the land of magic, everyone! Oh, wow, uh, this place is, is beautiful. This is, this is pretty cool. Whoa, I'm feeling so powerful. Oh, wow, we, we gotta come here more often. Not so fast. Oh shit, it's the devil from the last episode. Uh, yeah, duh. I mean, you guys never actually defeated me in the last episode. Well, this time, Todd has activated his powers as the Chosen One. He's descended from the gods and some of the most important people in history. Yeah, that's right. And, uh, and, uh, uh, Merlin, what exactly are my powers again? Well, first, let me tell you about your ancestors. You see, Todd is a descendant of Jupiter and Hera. Oh, hell yeah! I like where this is going. For he is a descendant of Poseidon, Lord of the Seas, and Apollo. Wait, what? Can you hang on a second? No, let's keep going, because Todd is also the descendant of Priapus, the Greek god of male genitalia, disguising himself as a camel and a farm girl. What? The Greek god of... what'd you just say? For he is a descendant of Zeus, disguising himself as a giraffe and a local homeless man. Wait, stop, hang on. This is, this is not what being descended from the gods is supposed to be about. Oh, this is exactly what it means to be descended from the gods. They were into some really weird shit. I mean, in one story, Zeus disguises himself as a swan and gets with this girl and she literally lays an egg. I'm not even kidding. Okay, fine. I, I guess I got excited about being descended from the gods, but I, but I didn't really think about it. Just, ugh, can we, can we move on, please? Well, we could switch gears from talking about the gods to the important historical figures you're descended from. Yes, let's do that instead, please. For you see, Todd is a descendant of King Henry VI of England and Joan of Arc. Okay, that sounds cool. I, I like it so far. He is also the product of a union between Atahualpa, the last emperor of the Inca, and Cleopatra. Uh, I'm pretty sure they would never have met. Let us not forget that he is also the descendant of the mighty Darth Vader and Rudolph. I love how red your nose is. Oh, come on! Those two aren't even real people! Oh, come at me, bro! What are you trying to say? 
Aw, oh, Santa, y you know I don't mean that. Y you know I believe in, in Christmas. Come on. Anyway, let's just keep going, because Todd is also the descendant of teenage Hitler and his secret teenage love affair with Jewish banking heiress Baron Marie Helene de Rothschild. Oh my god, wait, what? Hold on, did, did you really just say what I, what I thought you just said? So anyway, Todd... Merlin, you can't just gloss over that. Come on, no, stop, no more flashbacks. So Todd is also descended from some of the greatest seafarers in world history. Seafarers such as Blackbeard, Leif Erikson, and Christopher Columbus. I hear you also like rough waves. Boy, do I. Okay, again with the gay guys? How, how is that possible? I can't be descended from them. Oh, it's definitely possible. Remember that the Bible says Adam and Eve had three sons, which means we're all descended from three men. And I actually have a copy of the secret 67th book of the Bible, the book of Calvin the Fabulous, that gets into excruciating detail about how male pregnancy works. Oh, gross, man. Come on. No, nobody wants to hear that. Oh, snap. I, I forgot you were even here. Yeah, if you could just, you know, finish your little chat here about Todd's promiscuous ancestors, and we could actually, you know, battle, that would be uh, great. Yeah, you know, I think I get it. Can we just maybe move on from talking about my ancestors, please? Oh, come on, but we haven't even gotten to the best part yet, where uh, 20 of your ancestors party together and, let's say, engaged in loose moral activity at the same time. I, I think you get it. Oh, God, just kill me now. I mean, if you insist. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh you stabbed me. Oh, dude, what are you doing, man? This isn't how climactic battles work. You can't just start like that. What? Do you just expect me to keep standing here? You guys will take it forever. Dude, everyone knows how this works. You have to do the talking first and reveal all the trauma, and then you have the epic battle. I don't care. He was having some kind of identity <laughs> crisis. I just wanted a battle. Oh, no. Ugh, where am I? You are in the ancestral plane. Wow, is that is that Zeus? So so I can ask all you guys for advice on things? We've been watching you your entire life, every single moment. Like literally everything? Like every single moment of my life? Jar, me thinks you should clear your browsing history. You have brought great shame to the Zeus bloodline. Ah, uh, you guys must be making a mistake. That That's somebody else. I, I would never search those things. Oh, we know everything. Even what happened with Becky in the bathroom at prom. Char, yes, that wasn't your finest moment there, Todd. No, let's not talk about Becky. No, this is so weird that you've seen everything. Yeah, if you think about the implications of an ancestral plane for like more than five seconds, it's pretty weird. Ugh, okay, I don't want to be here anymore. Zeus, can you just tell me how to defeat the devil, please? Ugh, I mean, you could just speak the word Orgolon and it will banish him back to hell. Okay, good. I, I will just use that and I'll leave. Wait, before you go, don't you want to know what that word means? It's R-rated. Oh, baby, you wouldn't you like what to know? No, I don't want to know. You guys are gross. Ugh, I'm out of here. Guess who's back, Mr. Devil? Whoa, oh, you didn't die. Okay, are you ready to fight me? Not today, because I know how to banish you back to hell. Orgolon and be gone. No, you may have banished me today, but I'll be back for season two. So, uh, now that the devil's dead or gone or something, uh, Merlin, what do we do now? We must travel through the forest of the elves to get to a secret location where the prophecy of the Chosen One is hidden. Come, everyone, I will guide you there. Ugh, do we have to start walking again? Merlin, we've been walking for hours. When are we gonna get there? Yeah, and separately, has anyone else been getting the feeling for a while that we're being followed? It's the great Satan! He's returned! He will have our revenge! Uh, 
Uh, Santa, why are there angry Christmas elves? Uh, it's nothing. I I'm sure it's fine. He's the enslaver! Every year he kidnaps our brethren because too many die in the coal mines! He forces our brethren to mine coal just so he can prank millions of misbehaving children! Uh, Santa, is that true? Why are they brandishing weapons at us? Uh, no, no, I, 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 uh, I definitely give a, a unlimited paid vacation and, uh, paternity leave, yeah. Death to the great Satan! His tyranny ends now! Look, we should all just calm down. Here's the thing, uh, everybody run! Everybody run now! Oh god, I, I don't want to die! You guys can't tell anybody about how I get the elves!